guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm joined with a very special guest. Hi. Andy. We've done one collab before, but we decided that we wanted to do another one because this one's going to be better. Basically what we're doing is a chit chat get ready with me for BeautyCon because it is actually the day of beauty mm -hmm. month. So we just wanted to do the makeup portion on my channel and then we did everything else you guys could imagine for a get right with me on Kenzie's channel. So go check it out and be sure to subscribe to her channel. The video is currently on her face right now and it's also linked on the screen and it's in the description box down below so be sure to go check it out. And I'm gonna stop rambling and let's get on to it. I've done one of these before. They're really fun. Um, let's see. I'm going to start by priming and correcting. I'm a priming my face. Um, I'm not a makeup genius like Tori, so <laughs> don't judge me. It'll be okay. But I'm just priming my face with a green primer so it cancels that redness. I know. Oh, look at Ken. <laughs> I'm using the Tarte BB Tinted Treatment Primer. Well, it's like a BB cream. I'm gonna correct my under eyes. We so. also woke up at 6 a.m. to film. Oh my this god, video. we woke up at 6 a.m. Oh, guys, I meant to tell you, I've been vlogging more and I'm like literally addicted to it. Every single time I vlog, um, and I like end it and then I tell Ken, I'm like, I love vlogging. <laughs> so if you guys want to check out my vlog channel, there's going to be a link on the screen right now and it's also in the description box. It's really fun and Ken's vlogs too. So, mm -hmm. um, you can click right now for Ken's vlogs. There, but I love vlogging. Okay, my face looks so really orange. Like, look at that. It's okay. <laughs> I'm using, what is this? MAC Facing Body. You guys know it's my number one. I feel like a little toddler with my hair like this. Oh, I use the Maybelline like Instant Age Rewind, the really popular concealer under my eyes. I'm using a banana powder. I told Ken's, oh, I feel so bad because you're literally going to just be waiting for me for like 10 years. No, it's okay. That takes so I'm long. Gonna take... You're already on your contour. I'm not even a foundation. <laughs> oh. Okay, but I do my makeup really fast. Like all my friends back home, whenever I'd be doing my makeup, like when we were going out and stuff, mm -hmm. I would be done like 30 minutes before them, so I'll take a take my time. Yeah, take your time. Oh, guys, yesterday, I wish you guys were there. Um, yesterday, I went to a tea hosted by Gwen Stefani. There wasn't tea there. Though. There was no tea <laughs> in the high tea, but it was so cute because they decorated like everything, like emojis, like they had macaroons that were yellow and then they put like emoji faces on them. Mm -hmm. They had donuts shaped like pizza. I wish you guys were there. Like, I wish I could bring you to, like, all these events. I know. And, like, even, like, pictures and snapshots of these events and stuff don't do it justice. No, like, it's doesn't. always cooler there. And it sucks because, like, I wouldn't be able to go to these events without you guys. I feel that, I feel bad that I can't even bring you. So you're already, like, oh, the time. I feel like there's going to be a ton of comments of, like, Kenzie's face looks orange. It's just let it be. It, it isn't. It's the camera. Do you guys remember when I used to never set my face with powder? Because I was like, oh, my skin's normal and dry. I don't need to. Well, it looks better when I set it with powder. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I ever did before. I forgot my powder for the first time ever. This is the Naked Skin Concealer. I, like... And I used to like always do the thing where I would like put my concealer all the way out to like my temples, like the Kim K look. Like but, the, like a big Yeah, like beat. all the way out. But then I realized that my face is really circular and I don't know why I do that because it just makes my face look even rounder. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid that. So now I just put it in the center and like around my nose like that and I don't bring it out. I try to keep it as away from that area as possible and then... Even when I put my blush on, I put it all the way back here, but today I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to put on the apples and see if it makes my face look smaller. Because my face is a lot rounder than I thought that it was. I get so many questions on why I changed back to brown. First off, blonde looked bad on me. I don't know what you guys think, but I just hated it. Like, I liked being blonde because being blonde was, like, fun because I was like, blonde. But, like, you get different looks when you're blonde. Really? Like, yeah, you get approached very differently. Like, guys look at you differently, which is, like, scary. They look at you like me. Yeah. Which is weird. That is weird. I feel like I forgot to say what I did. Anyways, I just put on, like, a dandelion blush because I didn't really want to put on, like, much blush, but it gives you some color. So now I'm priming my eyes with Too Faced Shadow Insurance. What's your favorite primer? Um, I use, I don't have, like, a favorite. I just use whatever I see. Like, I have, like, a yeah, ton. I feel that. Like, recently... I've just been using concealer as my primer and mm -hmm. I like it a lot more. I'm setting my under eye concealer with the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder. 
I know that I stopped using this, but I missed it, so I'm using it again. I feel like I'm acting so dead on here, but it's also like so early. I promise I have a personality. I'm just so tired. It's okay. There are literally videos on my channel, like old videos, because I would like film before school sometimes. Yeah. And like, so How? I would have like the most insane morning voice. I'd be like, okay, so now. Wait, like when did you do this? I had no friends in 8th grade. I would literally film like before school. Oh, I'm putting Frisk from the Naked to Basics as my transition. Already on eyes. No, but I'm going to take a long time on my eyes. Okay, so I had Tori tell me what to do on my eyes. So like if it looks bad, it's okay. It's Tori's fault, basically. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just refer to myself in the third person, so that's... That's, it's Tori's fault. That's how my day is going. <laughs> I'm just setting everything with the Rimmel Stay Matte translucent powder. Honestly, I don't know what I did before I like set my my face. Did I go to BeautyCon LA last year? Well, when did we meet? Playlist Orlando. Okay. When did how did we become friends? I don't know how Ken said I became I don't know, friends. but then we collabed together. Um <laughs> Yeah, we did. Well, so now next what do I do? Tori, tell me. This is a uh, Tori tutorial. Ah, Tori like, tutorial. I cannot tell you how many times I've gotten that. I've gotten tutorial. Oh my gosh, that is so clever. <laughs> I've gotten that so many times. Like so many people, like in the comments, are like, oh my god, name your tutorials tutorials. I'm like, listen, I thought of that when I was in eighth grade. I've listen. been thinking of that for a long time now. That's actually really clever. While you're transitioning your crease, I'm transitioning color of my face with the MAC Baby Don't Go blush, but I use it as a bronzer. Pretty much the same. All right, I'm going in with the Anastasia Contour Kit, and I've realized that this bronzer, the one in the middle, oops, makes you, like, if I put on too much, it's black. Like, it turns legit black. I've heard that. It's I haven't used so that one in the middle. Weird. That like, is weird. At first, that's all that I used. I was like, oh, you know, it's good for me. But, like, I put on, like, literally a smidgen too much one time, and it was black. So now See, I use this one right here. I haven't even touched this one. I haven't either. That's the one I use. Maybe I should try it. No, not today. I'm going to cut the cheek. Okay, wait. So you're going to put was... that on the inner lid and then that on the inner corner gotcha. and under the brow bone. Got it. What? You're literally just going to be sitting here while I'm finishing my makeup. I'm not done. I've lost something to my eyebrows, mascara, which takes me like 10 years, winged eyeliner, like mini winged eyeliner. Okay. Many. I like how I have to clarify. Yes. So. Many wings. I switched from the Stila to the Kat Von D, and I use the Stila for like, since like 7th grade, I've just bought that like religiously, but now I like the Kat Von D a lot better. I've heard that. Yeah, it's really good. I go back in and I snatch the nose at the end. I use drag terms on like a regular basis. Okay, I'm yeah, trying I'm something new. I'm going to put blush just around like the center of my face. Actually, I'm not done with contouring yet. Actually, I'll hold off. Just give me a minute. This is Super Continental by MAC. I wish we could like play music right now without it being obnoxious. I know. But we can't. I've like hungry. debated so many times like wearing headphones when doing videos. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, I um, actually have to talk to you really seriously for a minute. Um, this product has changed my life and the way I look at life. Honestly, um, my outlook's completely changed. It is, and I don't know what I did before this product. It's the Makeup Forever Pro Sculpting Duo. There's like two shades of this. This is the lighter one, but this, this highlight, I just, I, just, I can't get enough of it. If, don't go there. Not fun. That looks really good. I have that. I have that uh, brush. They yeah. sent it to me. I use it for contour, and then I saw someone use it for highlight. I was like, why did I ever think of that? Yeah. It's perfect for highlight. I'm going to layer it on you. I know. Isn't that it? That highlight. I know, right? I'm going to start on my eyeliner. Oh, think of my God, that highlight. I just want to die. Since I don't contour my forehead, but my forehead's kind of big, um, I'm just going to take the bronzer in this, but I'm just going to take this and put it more on my forehead. So I'm going to attempt to fix this, but we'll see. Okay, I made it to the eyebrows. I'm trying to like lightly put it on. Like, is there a way to lightly put on powder? I like, not really. You know. <laughs> the other day I was telling my friend, I like don't know 
how to natural makeup anymore. <laughs> like, everything I do, like, because I can't put on conceal without putting on foundation. Then I can't put on foundation and conceal yeah, without setting it. Mm -hmm. And then I can't do that without putting on bronzer. And I can't put on bronzer without putting on blush. And I can't put on blush without highlight. So automatically, I already have a full face on. And then with a full face, I have to do brows. And then with brows, I have to do concealer on my eyelids. And then I can get away with, like, just mascara but it looks kind of weird so I put a little bit of crease definition in like I just can't like I have to do every single step since I've moved I haven't really been wearing makeup mostly because I'm just like lazy but what I do I normally like for like a lot I just wear like my BB cream and then I fill in my eyebrows because I've kind of been liking the no makeup look because it's like summer I don't know what I it feel is that. I feel like that. it's been nice I'm doing brows and you're doing liner so this is going to take some intense concentration yes. from both of us also I'm normally really good at this but anytime it, it's important I mess it up so like hopefully I'm not jinxing myself so but... we'll be back so scary perfect <sighs> We got it. Phew, that was really stressful. Yeah, I wasn't breathing. Yeah. I wasn't either. Oh my God. All right, I'll be back. <sighs> Brows are done. You should see some of the boys from my hometown. Really, really cute. I'm priming my eyes with concealer, and then I set it with translucent powder. She's literally done, and no. I'm just starting. What time do you tell you for your brunch? I gotta get going. <laughs> I don't have as much time as I thought that I did. We gotta rush. Okay, setting my um, yeah. concealer with translucent powder. Rim will say, Matt, you know the drill. My mascara is there real. Did you know that like, the minis are supposed to be better than the actual ones because they're samples? So mm -hmm. they make you want to buy them? Which, like, Whoa. I've noticed that they are. I never yeah. thought of that. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go in with my transition shade, and it's Yogurt by Mac. Me. We're good on time. Me. Rushing. Mm -hmm. I switched to a 224. Don't hate me. Alright, this is the <gasps> NARS eyeshadow in Callisto. It's like so cool. Oh, that's really pretty. Yeah, I'm obsessed with is it. Is that what you've been wearing on your lid? I wore that yesterday. Oh! Yeah, it's so pretty. I could like live off this color. Alright, now I'm gonna go in with this shade. I forget what it's called. It's this one though. It's really pretty. It's gonna go on the outer corner. Oh, this is the first video filmed like in my apartment. Kind oh, of. hi Molly. Hey Molly. Hey. All right, then I'm gonna take that bright purple color and put that on. That bright my purple color. Lower lash line. Oh, that pop. <laughs> Looks good. Looking good, kids. We're getting somewhere. Um, let's see. I'm gonna just highlight with Brulee by Mac, and then to highlight, we're gonna put a Digit, which is another purple on the inner corner. Yeah, it looks really good. Every time someone compliments me, I call them mom because my mom's the only person that compliments me. <laughs> <laughs> God, wow, I gotta hurry. Um, I need eyeliner, so I'm gonna put purple on my lower lash line. I'm gonna put that on my waterline and lower lashes. <laughs> this is stressful. Um, oh, eyeliner is what's gonna take me a while. All right, it's time for eyeliner, so I'll be right back. I'm using the Bobbi Brown. <laughs> Gel eyeliner. PRB. I'll be right back. <sighs> okay, eyeliner's done. Let's move on. <laughs> so I'm gonna quickly snatch. I just go in with the same shade that I used with the Anastasia contour can. I always snatch my nose since I got it pierced because I feel like the piercing kind of draws my nose out a little bit. You just gotta like change your whole face basically. Alright, and then I'm just gonna drag the highlight down the upper center of my nose. I don't bring it all the way down because I don't want my whole nose to be that high. 8.57. Oh, God! I'm gonna put mascara on. I'll be right back. So we don't have to be there at 10. She said I'll be there at 11. <sighs> we have more time now. I can relax. Thank God! Maybe I just have to put on fake lashes now. Kenzie's changing because I take really long. Mm -hmm. But I'm just gonna quickly do my lips because it takes like three seconds. But this is my this is my eye makeup. But for my lips, I'm gonna line them with the Natural Lip Liner by NYX. Ooh, I'm not back. changing it. <laughs> oh, honey, if you think this is the longest makeup video I've done, this lip liner matches my lips like perfectly. So I make my lips bigger. I'm in like a huge, huge lip gloss phase right now. I'm using this one by Makeup Forever. It's in the shade number 200. It's the Artist Plexi Gloss, and these are new. You really like MAC. Like, you have a lot of MAC stuff. Love MAC. That's my makeup. Now we're gonna go change, and then we'll be right back. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you all enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and tell us in the comments what your favorite pizza topping is.
I was actually gonna no say No way! I was thinking, oh my gosh, yes. Yeah, so comment <laughs> what your favorite pizza topping is because I definitely want to know because after BeautyCon, you best believe we're gonna be ordering a pizza. Make sure you guys also go check out Kenzie's channel and be sure to subscribe. I'm gonna give you guys like five seconds right now to subscribe. <laughs> Just waiting. Just here. Sips tea. <laughs> Okay, cool. So we did it. <laughs> Alright, so I really hope you guys all enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you in my next video. See ya. Bye.